Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, David, 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 damn monster, oh fuck, David, David, why are you chasing me? Why are you chasing me? <laughs> Gonna just save, and then find D. Where is the D? Don't quote me on that. Uh, D, 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 where are you, D? D, D. Wait, did I get a key out of that? Lecture, oh! I know where that is. Right here. Yeah. Keyhole. It's painted. Oh, found him. That didn't take long. Friends, faculty, and staff, I thank you for coming today. Today is, for us, the best day of our lives. Because today, we leave the nest of our school and begin to climb to adulthood. Those who passed the bar exam, those who didn't, those becoming clerks or notaries or teachers, all of us will be graduating from this school, and we owe a great debt to it. Though even if they manage to graduate, some of us may need to put a little more time into their studies. Oh, 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 oh so funny, so funny, so funny. Keep going. But these graduates have one thing in common. They're filled with hope for their future. They're ready to challenge what lies ahead. A toast to our dreams... To our, yet uns to our yet unsure futures, and may we have God's grace. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. 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 Absolutely beautiful speech. Beautiful. D, how did you get into this lecture room? Wasn't the hallway locked? Uh, you forget. I'm a graduate here. I know all the secret ways, dummy. Well, what are you listening to? A tape? Yeah, for my graduation day. Man, has it really been three years? I see a shiny up in the corner. I was getting nostalgic for the place. And even abandoned, it really hasn't changed. It's just like it was when I was taking classes. Studying was wearing me out, so I came here for a breather. It's, it's nice to have places full of memories like this. You graduated? But you're still studying? Hey, lay off it. Yeah, I couldn't pass the bar exam, so I'm cramming at home now. Oh my god, you look so beautiful, D. Next up's gonna be my sixth attempt. There were lots of great guys in my class. Most of them passed it in one shot. Being a lawyer's been my dream ever since I was a kid. So, who, who the fuck dreams to be a lawyer as a kid? Who the fuck? D, D, what's wrong with you? So I was, So I was so happy when I got accepted here. I felt I was one step closer to making it come true. The work was rough, and I ba just barely managed to graduate. I think it's my kind, helpful professors that did it. I'll pass the next time for sure. I mean, it's my sixth time. Any more and I'll be way behind my classmates. I think you already are, Dave. D. Well, it's good to be motivated, but it's dangerous here. You should get out of here soon. Huh? Dangerous? What? It's sort of hard to explain. There's a kind of monster here. It'll attack you if it finds you. I thought you were just some weird old guy wandering in an abandoned school. But damn, you really are nuts, huh? Seriously? A monster? Even though girls don't believe that stuff, you're being a total doofus. Hey, you're not nice. Those names hurt. Do you enjoy making fun of people? And I don't think I'm much older than... Don't try to debate me, alright? I'm a talented soon-to-be lawyer. You'd be no match for me. You're a cocky son of a bitch, aren't you? Do what you want. But don't say I didn't warn you. Yeah, I will do that, thanks. Like I need a shady punk like you telling me what to do around my alma mater. You, sir, are an asshole. Okay? Alright. Hey, Paul. I got in. What? Really? You got in to flight school? That's crazy, David. I can't even do a handstand. You can do it if you really try, man. Thanks, but it doesn't make me a pilot yet. Still have to pass the exam. Man, dude, you totally will be. And make sure to give me a ride. I'd love to fly around the city sometime. Paul, I'm not going to be flying passenger planes. It's not that kind of school. Don't sweat the details. I'm glad for you. You did good. Hey, I'll take you to lunch today. Oh, he's such a good friend. Paul is such a good friend. Back then, I wasn't really thinking. I was just going wherever I wanted. Maybe D is like that, too. No. 
All right. I'm going to check out this shiny thing. The Julia Stone School's newspaper is posted up. Big stand from Michelle Stadam. Today we must pay tribute to our friend Michelle for his great for his latest achievement. His dissertation in regards to current international law has made an appearance in Regal Collection. Majoring in global jurisprudence in Sidney Patterson's class, he continues to study hard in the hopes of becoming an international lawyer after graduation. Below is a full text of blah, 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 blah. Uh, Michael stayed on birthday 619, age 20. 619. 619. Wasn't there something, like a note or something about his birthday? 619. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, because Sidney's code is... His because they share the same birthday. So 619. 619 what though? It's not a three digit code. 61920? I don't know how that would make sense, but okay, well, I've got part of the code at the very least. Uh anything over here of interest? Mine with reference books, reference books, reference books, more and more reference books. Lots of books. I've established this. There are lots of books in this game. Okay, uh, locked. Ooh, a note. The rule matches these other pages, so he was here. Many hopes were fulfilled here. Many youths were blessed. But I didn't receive that blessing. Is he Michael or Michelle? The crooked man. Ooh, ooh, it all makes sense. It all makes sense because he's the crooked man. This Michelle guy, or Mikel, or what the fuck ever. He must be the crooked man. I don't know. I'm just, I'm, I'm probably just talking out of my ass. I have no idea. But why would he be bugging David? That's the question. I mean, David did move into his house, so whatever. What's the problem with me? Who refused to pick me and left me in the dust? I loathe those meaningless days. He had a leaflet for this school. It was, it was in the desk. Felt like it was important. Was he trying to be a lawyer like Dee was? I guess this would imply he didn't become one. Keyhole painted over. Oop. Alright. Anything, anything, anything under the tables. I'm not going to check each one. It seems kind of pointless. But okay, moving on. I'm going to go check out Sydney's room now. Uh, so... It would be, I guess, 614... Was it 61420? Was that the code? Uh, 61420, right? 61920, okay. 61920. 61920. <clears throat> but that'd be a five-digit code. That's weird. I don't know. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Uh, do, do, do up one floor that's what i need to do go up a floor all right uh is this it is this her room yep yep okay so uh this is, i did definitely that is definitely it but uh zero six is it zero six nine one nine yeah I'm so fucking smart. I didn't even play this part. And I didn't look up a walkthrough because I'm a genius. I'm a genius. I'm not very smart because this is probably a really easy puzzle. And I'm bragging about it. And that makes me seem like such a dumbass. But I don't care. I'm proud of me. It contained a key to the lecture rooms. Noise. Noise, noise, noise. Noise. Uh, Andrew Robinson. Okay, so I'm going to head to the lecture rooms now. Yeah. The lecture room's bottom floor where I just was. Right here. I'm doing good. I'm proud of me. Was it the... Was it one of these? One of these doors? No, this one wasn't locked. I'm gonna save because I don't know what to expect. And I, it's got me terrified. Ah, got it. What do we got here? Another note. I knew there was something I lacked, but I didn't want to admit it. My ambitious youthfulness wouldn't let me. I wanted someone to say it. I wanted to be woken up. To be told I'm a have-not. Something you lacked. A have-not. It's true. There are haves and have-nots. People whose dreams can come true and... 
Oh god, another flashback. Again? Sometimes my head just starts hurting bad. Finally, it. Fuck! 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 Thank God I saved! Fuck! Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, David, 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 damn monster, oh fuck, David, David, why are you chasing me? Why are you chasing me? Oh fuck. I, I've not, I have not seen this part, so I have no idea what's gonna happen. Fuck. Uh, David? Why didn't he finish me off? I'm alive? The monster's gone. I thought it would kill me, but it left. Damn it. Damn it! Ugh, my neck hurts. I feel so sluggish. I haven't really slept since yesterday. I should try to rest somewhere. Uh, no, not a good idea. And he's walking slowly. I'm going to save, just in case. Because fuck that shit. Uh, the infirmary should be a good place to rest. I I would assume so. Poor David. <sighs> Poor guy. But yeah, I have not been this far. So I don't know what to expect. Just take a nap. Sleep all your problems off. It's okay. I'll take a little nap. Pushing myself wouldn't be a good idea. Oh, fuck. Stop crying. Mom? Are you crying again? Sorry, I can't do a thing. I can't even console you. A dream. Yeah. Mom always cried in the living room. After I'd gone to bed at night. That was when I was a kid, though. Well, I'm feeling better now. All right, let's go. Well, just gonna save again. Can't be too careful. Yeah, I have no idea when I'm gonna stop this recording because I'm just gonna play until I get stuck or something. I don't know, I don't know. I, I don't know what to do now. Uh, what did I get? Uh, items, did I get anything? I don't remember. I picked up the book, yeah, but I didn't get anything out of it. I'm gonna just check around, I guess. It's locked. Basement reference room. Okay, locked. All right. Nothing new so far. Six digit pin. What? How did that monster get out of here? I don't know. I don't know, David. I do not know. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. He got out. But I, I still have the key, don't I? Don't I? I don't have the key anymore? Where's the key? Huh. Okay. I thought maybe, I don't know, there would be something new and I'd have to unlock the door and go in it and check it out, but apparently not. Apparently not. Apparently not. Wait a minute. I remember a note that said somebody lost a book in one of the lecture hallways with a code on it. So maybe it's under a table? Or in a bookcase? I am searching like mad to find it. Huh. Huh. 921 in the auditorium. Crime among the impoverished and its prevention. Ivan, Ivan, blah, 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 criminal behavior, a psychological approach, will be referenced, so be sure to read it before it coming. Bransmore, profesh, professor of criminology. Criminology! Okay, so Ivan, yada, yada, yada. Ivan, yada, yada, yada. So would that be in the reference room? I'm gonna check there, I guess. 
check the reference hall. Uh, is it this way? Yeah, no, that's the janitor. I'm a stupid. Is it over here? No, that's the infirmary. I was just there. Second floor. That's where it was. Ooh, is it in here? This one? Aha! No? No? Okay, then. Is there a list of checked out books that I can... No? Okay. Philosophy of law, civil law... Criminal law. Criminal history, criminology. Oh, found it. Criminal behavior, a psychological approach. Uh, that notice in the lecture room mentioned this. I don't understand a word of it. Great. Huh. There's a slip of paper in here. What's the number? 99814. That is the book that it was. Oh, that's the book. That's the book. That's the book. That's the book I'm looking for. I'm going to save because I don't trust this. But that is the book I'm looking for. Uh, for somebody's code. So, up a floor and then one of these rooms, I think. Um, is it this one? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, it, it's this one. Yes. Fuck, I forgot the code. Fuck. Fuck, I forgot the code. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. God fucking damn it. 9981991991981991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991991
That's the big idea, huh? Did something happen? Forget about it. Sorry to startle you, it's nothing. Hey, dude. You okay? You're super pale. I'm just kinda tired. I came a long way and I haven't slept. Leave me alone. I can't be bothered to talk. Have this. Oh, you're so nice, D, even though you're a bit of an asshole. Huh? I already had a little, but it's an energy drink. Drink up. What? Seriously? I don't need this. I told you, leave me be. Drink it! Jeez, you really look like you need food and drink. And I'm being nice, so at least accept it, will ya? Alright. Thanks. But what's all this from the guy who's calling me a shady punk? Mostly because you look like crap, dude. Come on, it's not like I'm heartless. I mean, I am trying to be a lawyer. Besides, maybe it's fate. I'll tell you what, I won't call you shady anymore. Now cheer up. You could be my client once I'm a lawyer. Huh, <laughs> that's a pretty quick turnaround. I'm grateful at any rate. Say, have you seen anyone else around? Particularly a man about my age? Huh? No, nobody. He's who you're looking for? Yeah, though I don't really know how he looks. Tell me if you see him, okay? You got it. Doubt anybody'd be here, though. Oh, but can I ask you something, too? Professor Andrew. He always helped me out. His room's on the third floor, but it's got a number lock, so I can't get in. I was thinking the professor might still have some lecture notes for me around or something. But yeah, tell me if you get it open, okay? Alright, got it. I'll wander around some more, then. You look like hell, so don't push yourself. Oh, you're so good to me, D. You're so good to me. Thank you. Yeah, well, you be careful, too. If you see any monsters, get away. Not this again. Yeah, yeah, sure. I've got a knife to defend myself anyhow. Smell ya. Oh, we're besties now. We're besties. See ya, bestie. I don't have any friends. Maybe he's not as bad as I thought. Got an energy drink. Sweet. Sweet. Okay, so what was the code again? Uh, 144246. 144246. I'm gonna save. 144246. 144246. Help me find a bed. Someone. Please. I'm so tired. I have a job, you know. I wish I could just do this all night and get paid for it, but I don't. I, I don't get paid at all for my YouTube videos. Please. I want a bed. That's all I want. 